In case you're wondering why there is no chapter 38 of anti PD in this show, it's because I was not interested in making a chapter out of Mr. Han's backstory. I was like, wake me up when Param finally gets his brain straight again. Man, I want to just dropkick Mr. Han because he knew Param was seeing we and still tried to get it with Param. Anyway, before we get started, I just want to remind our viewers that if you like seeing more Yaoi content and would like to support this channel, please don't forget to smash that like button. Also, if you haven't done so, please subscribe to this channel and hit that notification bell. Feel free to message me in my Twitter or Instagram at SealedFujoshi, which I'll be using to interact with viewers about more Yaoi content. If that's something that interests you, feel free to follow at SealedFujoshi. Finally, this video will contain explicit content and a lot of manual spoilers. With that in mind, please proceed with caution. You have been warned. Now, without further ado, let's jump into chapter 39 of Anti-PT. You all, I don't know why everyone is so mad and angry all of the sudden to Param and Mr. Han. Param literally got hot and bothered about Mr. Han just by looking at him at the beginning of this series. The only reason Param and we met was because of Param was getting hard from being near Mr. Han. Don't get me wrong, I obviously like we much better than Mr. Han. But how is Param supposed to just get over the man he had a huge crush on for the longest time? Or Actually, I don't know, maybe he just can't get just can't control the dopamine rush. But whatever it is, we know in this chapter that Param's head is with Mr. Han, but his heart belongs to we. Param really said he has feelings for someone else. But then again, we also know, in his head, he said, I'm a fuck Mr. Han right now. <laughs> Param needs to realize that we is the one he really likes. As long as God allows we to be the end game, then I'll look over this last session he had with Mr. Han. But I am also very disappointed at Param. I understand that Param has a long-standing crush with Mr. Han, but he needs to get his priorities in order. I'm a big Wii supporter, supporter, obviously. And all the way, I will support Wii. But I need to remind myself to put myself in Param's shoes from time to time that Param has a long time crush on Mr. Han and one of the reasons his body was sensitive was because of Mr. Han. Param ain't even in a relationship with we yet. He's only human, a trashy one, but to be honest, he's quite confused, you know? So I keep telling myself that I need to chill and enjoy the drama. Let's be honest here. We all know love in reality is really messy. It's not all fluffs and rainbows. I just have to tell myself that if it takes a little bit of pain to get to the chapter where Param ends up with we, I'm okay with it. We can get through this together, friends. This manhwa is so underrated, to be honest. It's not the stereotype boys love like most of the other love triangles out there 
where the uke sleeps with one of them. Here in Antipiti, we get to see Param sleep with both of them. Even though it hurts, I'm glad to see something different for once. At the beginning of this chapter, I was like, yes, Param, please leave the car, like right now. I'm screaming, he needs to leave the car. But, you know, after thinking a little bit, I was, I realized that if Param needs to fuck Mr. Han once to get it out of his system and for him to realize that he doesn't like Mr. Han anymore, then so be it. I don't only blame Param, okay? I also blame Mr. Han. I blame Mr. Han for taking advantage of Param's weakness, even when Param already rejected him because he is hurt. I understand that Mr. Han's relationship history is also shitty too. You know, I know I don't want to talk about chapter 38, but you know, his backstory is that he met a guy way back from high school and they became the best friends and also developed feelings for each other. But you know, Mr. Han's first love was a shitty person. Uh, this guy wasn't content with Mr. Han, so he fucked another guy. And, you know, Mr. Han, since this was his first love, he had a lot of plans with his first love until one night he catches them screwing each other at Mr. Han's dormitory. And, of course, all of his plans back in the day he had to throw away until he met Param. Param was special to him. You know, when Mr. Han first saw Param in the company, Param is adorable, hardworking, and friendly. And Mr. Han trusted his feelings for Param. But let's be honest here, like, you know, Mr. Han lied about not knowing about Param's feelings, making Param feel embarrassed because Mr. Han was just toying with his feelings. Sometimes I can't even blame Param. I've been there and it's hard to resist someone you've yearned for for such a long time. So, to sum up chapter 39 of Anti PT, it's just simple lust. Everything that's going on between Param and Mr. Han, it's all lust, nothing else. We know that one way or the other, we is going to win this love triangle. And we all know that, you know, the author will find a way to jump over this hurdle that you know Param is going through whatever it is let's just enjoy the chapters we can all agree that we is endgame and Mr. Han is a shitty person and let's just enjoy this wonderful series anyway I hope you enjoyed today's episode Please don't forget to follow my social media to be teased about some of the boys' love that I'm interested in. Feel free to leave me a message and converse with me. I'd love to hear back from you. Also, don't forget to support the author. All the manhwa details can be found in the description below. Again, thank you so much and hope to see you next time. And before I forget anything, I want to wish all of my viewers and listeners a very happy new year. This podcast and show will not be here without you guys. I'm really thankful that, you know, in the past couple of months that I've been live, there has been a lot of support from you guys and I really do appreciate it. It's a great motivator for me and I want 2021 
to be a bigger year for Sealed Fujoshi. And I hope you guys will be there on that journey. Bye.